So here we are. Jimmy and Aaron, these, there are great things, really, really wonderful things in store for the two of you. And as we prepare to hear your vows for each other here today, I want you to know on behalf of me and your entire family, your loved ones, your guests, your friends, every single one of us here today that we love you, we support you in this marriage, and we wish all of life's greatest blessings for you as you begin this next chapter of your life together. start out by congratulating uh, Aaron and Aaron's parents as well as my own for raising two amazing people. Jimmy and Aaron are two of the most compassionate, hardworking, and dedicated people I know and I cannot imagine a better match for each of each other. I remember after meeting Aaron for the first time, Savannah and I talked about how well she seemed to fit naturally into our family and three years later we still feel the same way about her. Aaron, I could not have imagined a better match for my brother, and I thank you for all the joy and happiness that you bring me. Jimmy, you're the best brother that I could have ever asked for, and I look up to you today more than ever. On behalf of the bridesmaids and groomsmen, I would like to thank Jimmy and Aaron for asking us to be a part of their special day. I wish the two of you a long and happy marriage together. Cheers to the new Dr. and Mrs. Kennedy. Now, Jimmy, when Erin moved here to Charleston from L.A. four years ago, she do, didn't know it yet, but she came here to meet you. At the time, it was only the promise of you, the promise that she'd meet the man that she'd want to spend a lifetime with, and that she'd spent a lifetime until date dreaming of. But then you walked into her life, and she hasn't once looked back since that first time that you met each other. my soon-to-be wife. I happily take you to be my partner and best friend. I happily take you to be my partner and best friend. Jimmy, my soon-to-be husband. I happily take you to be my partner and best friend. I happily take you to be my partner and best friend. Through life's joys, successes, and sorrows. Through life's joys, successes, and sorrows. I promise to support you, to respect you, and to love you. I promise to support you, to respect you, and to love you without condition for the rest of our lives. Without condition for the rest of our lives. I vow to bring joy, strength, and imagination to our relationship. I vow to bring joy, strength, and imagination to our relationship. I will strive to build a home filled with compassion, laughter, and gratitude. I will strive to build a home full of joy, compassion, and gratitude and to raise kind, independent, and humble children. And to raise kind, independent, and humble children. Today, I proudly pledge my eternal love, devotion, and loyalty to you. Today, I proudly pledge my eternal love, devotion, <laughs> and loyalty to you. In front of our closest friends and family. In front of our closest friends and family. I want to welcome everybody. Uh, this is a long time overdue. Uh, you know, we were supposed to be together in April of this past year and the events, uh, the pandemic and all that altered it. But uh, we couldn't be more happier to be uh, united with the Kennis family. Jimmy is such a catch and I know Aaron and Jimmy are gonna be very happy uh, from here on. My heart's full right now. I'm watching everybody respond to you. There's so much love in this space, and it's because you guys touch so many people, not just surface. I mean, you go, you build relationships. And I feel very confident that you're gonna grow old together, and you're gonna have 
Uh, maybe four kids, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> so anyway, here's to a beautiful life together. I love you very much. she was and you know if you if you're on my side of the family you don't know Jimmy as well spend time with them and you will see how much Jimmy just adores Aaron I mean it's just it's so plain and it's so sweet and um, it, it make it warms my heart so much that Aaron is so happy I want you to know that you're not just my sister you're my best friend. I wish all the world's happiness for you both because you deserve every single ounce of it. You both do. With that, with the power invested in me by the state of South Carolina, I'd like to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great honor to introduce, for the very first time, Dr. and Mrs. James Kennis.